So, I don't know what I was thinking when I was uh, 11 years old, but anyways, um, I was a very responsible uh, child. So, um, my... Responsible, yeah. So, uh, my parents, uh, like, are like, all right, you, you can go on bike rides. So then, so then, um, I'm with a friend, and I'm like, what should we do? So then we go on a bike ride, we go to CVS, and we're, I'm like, all right, so I've got, like, my sixty-one ninety-five dollars and I want to buy something. So, like, we probably bought, like, I don't know, something at CVS. But then... I had a brilliant idea. So you see, I was like, wait a second. I want to buy something on Amazon. It's much bigger than a CVS store. So then, after we bought our, I don't know, junk or whatever, uh, we, I, I was like, all right, so there's this debit card. And I'm like, what? And I'm like, what's a debit card? It's like a c- credit card that you load money on. It's what the cashier said. Uh, and then, so then I just, like, got, like, a one fifty dollars and I had to pay $2 of, like, fees, okay? So, $52, I got this card, and, um, I bring it home, and it says, uh, you can't use it, uh, until you activate it. So I go to, uh, the credit card website, the debit card website, and, I'm, and I go to it, and I'm like, wait. So then, it, so then it asks me to make an account. So I make my account. I probably set my birth date to like 2000 or something. Uh, and I don't know. So I was old enough. Or like 1900s. I don't know. I don't know what I set my birth date to. But it was definitely not um, my current birthday. It's not my real birthday. <laughs> I think I sent the month and the day to the same thing as my current. But like the year was like 20 years off. Uh, so then I was eligible. So then... Um, it asked for my email, asked for my phone, so I just entered my email, my mother's phone, and I just prayed that they wouldn't call her. I just prayed that they wouldn't call her, and, um, because she, obviously she had no idea that I had this thing. So anyways, um, I'm off, and I'm like, uh, I've got this card that's basically useless because it needs my social security number to activate it, and, like, I'm, I'm an 11-year-old, okay? So, like... Um, my parents won't, like, when you're 11 years old, I don't know if your parents entrust you with their social security number. Anyways, um, so I'm like, wait a minute, so I've got this useless car that I spent $50 on that does absolutely nothing. It does absolutely nothing. And I'm like, all right, that was stupid. I can't return it. I can't do anything. So I've got, like, $50, okay, on a card that's worth nothing. So then, of course, I just put it in my wallet, um, it's so funny that they put those credit card holder spots in ch- kids' wallets, so I had, like, a child wallet. I don't know. Anyways, I put it in, and I'm like, I'll just forget about it. I just kept, like, one or two manuals and whatever, but and then I asked my dad, Dad, can you help me activate it? And, of course, he thought that Mom had let me, and my mom never even found out, okay? So, um, here, so, so then we, uh, tried to activate it. Um, and we called them because we couldn't. We entered all the stuff. He he uh, did my social security number thing for me. And we did all the stuff, okay? So then we called them and we're like, wait, so why do you need his social security number? It makes zero sense why a debit card company would need your social security number to activate a debit card. He was like, debit cards usually come like, like you can just buy stuff, right? Um, and they're like, oh, because we are under government and... uh." That kind of stuff, so we need to collect information on our users. Yay. So anyways, gave them all the stuff, and then we found out there was a huge tax every time I purchased something. So, like, if I wanted to buy some stuff on Amazon, then um, my $50 on my card would probably be worth, like, 20 or 30 So it was like, my dad's like, so let me get this straight. You bought a card that's, like, for... People who have really bad credit, uh, because, um, and they need something that looks like a credit card to, like, I don't know, buy stuff online. And I'm like, yeah, I don't have credit. And I need a credit card so I can buy stuff online. That's the reason I got it. And he was like, so we're going to just get you a refund. So he helps me get a refund. And anyways, I've now I've got, like, a $49, 40, $45 check just sitting somewhere. I don't even know where I put it. And anyways, that's the story of... Uh, <laughs> 
my debit card at CVS. Um, and uh, this is back when I was 11, and I hope I won't make the same mistake again. So, yeah, thanks for watching. I'm probably going to put some, like, Bed Wars over this. I'm not quite sure. Probably going to put some Bed Wars gameplay. Because, of course, I'm not recording this audio voiceover and playing Bed Wars. That's, like, impossible. I tried it. I tried it, okay? I tried. I'm just not that fluent at the game. I've only played, like, so many times. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed today's video. And I'll see you in the next one. Get your butt out.